Welcome to the Crack Tessa, everyone. If you are new, my name is Vanessa. On today's DIY video, we're going to make this chic and glam pineapple with a tray, uh, perfect for summer, uh, and it looks pretty high end. Make sure to follow me on Instagram and Facebook, where I post super quick and easy DIYs, and subscribe to my YouTube channel, where I post new videos every week. Now let's get crafting. So I'm gonna take this pineapple uh, drinking cup that I got at the Dollar Tree. I love the shape and I love the detail of the pineapple. So the only thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna remove the straw and the tag. Don't mind my hands that have paint on them already. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take some acrylic paint from the Dollar Tree and give it a quick coat, just one coat, quick and easy. Uh, and then I'm going to spray paint it. Sometimes uh, on certain things that are especially shiny, like this uh, cup, I give it a quick acrylic coat and then I will spray paint it white. So I'm going to finish with this layer. I'm gonna let it dry and then later I'm going to spray paint it using Rust-Oleum white. So I'm going to take the top of the pineapple cup and I'm going to spray paint it uh, using the Rust-Oleum metallic gold paint. I'm going to give it one coat, let it dry, and then I'll give it another. Let's continue. So now this is the second part of this project. I'm going to take this uh, silver tray, which is also from the Dollar Tree, and I'm going to spray paint it white. Uh, this one, I'm not gonna give it any coat of the acrylic before I spray paint it, because this is a different texture, a different material. So with the gloss white from Rust-Oleum, I'm going to give it two coats of spray paint, and I'm gonna let them dry in between each coat. Let's finish that. So now that the tray is dry, I only did the top, I didn't do the bottom, I'm going to take this piece of scrapbook paper that I got at Michael's. Uh, it has uh, some gold foil to it and it's a pineapple print. So I think it's going to look perfect for um, this display. And the only thing I'm going to do is I'm going to basically measure it just with my hands. I just make folds. I crease the folds with my hands and then I'm going to trim it so it could fit the tray. I don't even hot glue it, I don't mod podge it, because this way I can change this paper out if I wanna change it for any other season or any other type of decorations. So let's continue with that. So this was a super simple and easy DIY, which looks fantastic. I really do love the way it turned out. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe and hit the little bell to get notified when I post new videos. Thanks for watching. See you all on my next DIY.